Hey folks, welcome back. So this week we are continuing on with the Egg and Wagon project. And the first thing that I want to do on here is at least on the ends where it kind of slopes up where the rafters come up from our like five foot side up to the six foot side. What I'm going to do is I'm going to fill that in with some quarter inch hardware cloth. And I've actually got that right here. And so it's just a sort of a, a wire mesh, welded wire kind of thing. And I'm going to use that to fill in that area and that'll give some ventilation going through there. Uh, so of course obviously we've got good ventilation in the bottom with the floor and then we'll have a little bit along at the ends as well. Uh, hopefully that should keep it a little cooler in the summer. And then also I'm not sure if I'll do it on the front or not. Maybe like a foot along the front. Not sure if I want to do that or not but definitely we're going to do that on the ends. So for the siding and the roof, what we're going to do is we're going to reuse some of this old stuff that came off of and out of some of the old buildings that have now collapsed that were around in this area. I think this should work pretty well for what we're doing. I mean, it's a chicken coop after all, so I think this probably should be fine. Oh, trying to break stuff already. Alrighty, we're gonna see if we can't get a few sheets of this roofing on this side of the egg and wagon. All right, so the first project again for today is to do some watering on all this stuff. It's been kind of hot over the last few days and it's been I think two days since I watered last. Now for what it'll get later in the summer this is about average but when it started out at like 40 something the beginning of the last week and then it was up into the mid 80s by the end of the week it felt absolutely miserable. Uh, and then I think in another couple days it's supposed to cool down by 20 degrees or something so 
Uh, it's it's just all over the place. But either way, we got to get all this stuff watered, particularly the potatoes. Um, get both sets of those watered back in again to make sure that they get a really good start here at the beginning of the season. All right, well, we're getting back to putting siding on the egg and wagon here. And I think the next one we'll work on is this, this longer, the, no, the shorter of the longer sides. Get that one done. Okay, so I made a small error here on the framing on this end back here. And that is that I spaced these studs two feet apart, but I did it just measured off from this end framing. So in other words, uh, this stud right here from the edge from that side is actually two feet four inches because I've got this framing along here and the end framing is within that framing so like that stud is two foot four inches from the edge and this one is four foot four inches from the edge now the problem with that is that these sheets of metal that I have here are actually exactly 12 feet long so it works great for this project but if I'm going to split them into a part that is eight feet long because that's how wide this is and then I'll have a four foot piece that means that I need a stud that is right on four foot in the middle here and this is at four foot four inch from that side so what we're going to do is we're going to grab the reciprocating saw cut out the nails from there and out of the bottom and move that over a few inches nail it back in place and then we can work on getting the end sided All right, well that is three out of our four sides done. And of course this end down here is where our door's gonna go. So uh, this really only has just a little bit there and a little bit there that needs to be sided. So I think we're gonna need to grab another sheet of this roofing siding stuff that we're using. We just got about eight feet of it left and we're gonna need a little bit more than that. So if we grab that, we can get at least the siding wrapped up tonight.
Well folks, we are gonna cut this video right here. Originally I thought we might include doing all the roofing in this one as well, but it just got way too long and I don't like editing videos that get too long. So because I was feeling a little bit lazy, you guys are getting a shorter video this week. And then uh, next time we'll be uh, moving on to the roof and getting all that stuff done. So that is gonna be it for this video. As always, I appreciate you guys watching and I will see you next time.